Baba. <gasps> locate the exits nearest you and keep in mind they may be behind you straps and hold your wrists and aisle armrests are lowered guys we made it to stark bowl as soon as dana picked me up from the airport we immediately went and picked up lunch from one of our favorite places called nutri groove it's so delicious so yummy so i was really excited to go there we've basically just been hanging out we have dinner reservations tonight at eight she and i are going on a little girly date i'm about to start getting ready I'm just cozy still in my airport outfit this is the room that i stay in Fun fact, Dana does art on the side. She's a cute little artist. So this is like her art corner. And I'm making the bed right now. I'm going to this place called Anthony's. And I'm thinking, I'm more gonna get dressy. And I'm excited to get dressy because I feel like I never go anywhere to like dress up. A little update on the flight. Standby today was the easiest it's ever been. As flight attendants, you know, we go through a different security line when we're working flights and we can actually go through that security line whenever we're non-revving as well. I've never done it whenever I'm non-revving because normally I just go through like the normal basic security with DB. And so I asked a few of my friends about it and they're like, oh my gosh, yes, it's gonna like change your life. It was actually life-changing. Like didn't have to take off my shoes, didn't have to pull out my laptop. That was a nice little surprise. When I checked the flights again, they looked great. There was like 30 something seats open. So I was like, oh, I should be able to make it. Shouldn't be a problem. I got first class. That doesn't really mean much because it's like the tiniest plane. That's always exciting. Doesn't matter if it's 
a big plane or a small plane. Getting first class is a little treat. I'm flying back on Tuesday like super early in the morning and as of right now flights look great so I should be good. I'm not really stressed about that. Can I request mine to be extra cool? <laughs> Um. Thank you. Happy Sunday, you guys. Dana and I are making a little cheese board. It is 6 p.m. We've just had a lazy day. Hey, Dana. Hey, guys. <laughs> We haven't done hardly anything today. We did wake up, we were cozy on the couch, drank some coffee. We did make it to church and it was so fun. <laughs> I just ignored it. We went to the 11 o'clock service. It was really fun. It was so nice to go. And then we met her dad for lunch. We came back and watched the American Nightmare documentary, which was really good. I've been seeing it all over Netflix and people talk about it on social media. We watched that and it was great. And now we're just gonna make a cute little cheese board. Nate, what happened? What happened? <laughs> Are you okay? It's okay. I just got the tip. Almost cut the tip of my... <laughs> alarm oh my gosh that okay? scared me yeah it didn't puncture i mean it didn't oh, like there's not even, it's not go even deep. bleeding i know it's not even bleeding but i feel look it's trying to come out it's like a bit well you keep squeezing it because <laughs> i cut it with the tip it's like a paper cut be careful edit that out <laughs> Anna made us um paper bag cookies <laughs> I don't know if the we're. I don't know if we're actually a fan. Um, we keep nibbling. Well, I keep nibbling on them. They're okay. They're okay. Do you want the white one, Boo? Or do you want any? Yes. Here we go. Cheers. Cheers, Boo. Yay. Cheers. This is definitely a girl dinner. We got our little candle going to make it cozy, and we're gonna watch True Detective. I ended up putting like one of my. Oh, I like. So we've migrated from the couch to Sonic. The blue raspberry nerd slushy. Oh. <laughs> what the blue raspberry nerd slushy. What? Thank you. I've oh never had a nerd slushy. It was so yummy. Mmm. Thanks for making that little pit stop. Mm -hmm. oh. Hallelujah. Look at us walking. <laughs> Babe. Uh, I always think that house is so cute. It is really so cute. Cutie. Spooky. Oh, so early. Oh, no. Guard <laughs> in your seat pocket. As we complete our...
<laughs> I was feeling kind of wild. I'm gonna switch it up, do something crazy. I wanted to come on here and close out my video because I got home from Dana's. It was such a great time. DB picked me up from the airport. Easy breezy, made it on the flight. Wasn't really concerned. There were like 30 something seats open. So I was like, I usually don't even look at the list when there's 30 something seats. And it's such a small airport that I don't really stress about it unless there are limited seats. But we made it home. It's been a few days and now we have a new do. I went and got my hair done last night. This was pre-planned. It's not like I went to the salon and I was like, cut it off. I have been thinking about it for a while. My hair has just been really sad since the wedding. I haven't had it done since September. If you want to go ahead and close out this video, I appreciate you guys watching. Definitely have some more flight attendants videos coming up for you guys. So stay tuned in the next few weeks. And if you did like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also leave me comments. I love chatting with you guys. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.